and thanks for watching Mid Morning. After a two year absence at the Hennepin County Government Center, the payphone is back. Yep, the people running the information desk asked that it be reinstalled. That was after a handful of people a day needed to use one. And we actually ran into one guy this week who used the phone to call his brother. Huh. Yeah, so we answered this good question How many of us have smartphones? But or first, have to use the payphone. Yeah, but first, can we go back to the payphone? Yes. Please, let's. I mean, really. This. I, when was the last time you used a payphone? So I thought about this. I have a distinct memory of using my a payphone with a prepaid phone card. Yeah, in, interesting. It's probably been early 2000, about 15 years ago, right. in we, Ireland. So I don't know if oh, I used Ireland. it in the U.S. For me, I think it's been 14 years. I would say that's probably right Irish around one. the time that cell phones really started to become popular. Exactly, yeah. or at least like enough of your friends had a cell right. phone that you didn't have to use the pay phone. But it was right. like a quarter and you, you were good to go. Oh, it's now up to 50 cents. I oh, was so excited. Yeah, I was so excited. I called my husband and I said, <laughs> hey, guess what? I'm calling you from a pay phone. I mean, it was just sort of this Was he as excited novelty. as you were? No, he no. was not. He never is. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Oh, man. Okay, so why did they, they got rid of the pay phone, what, two years ago? Yeah, they did. So I actually think this is a really cool story. The woman at the information desk, if you ever been to the Hennepin County Government Center downtown she's there all the time she's wonderful yeah. she said people would keep coming up to her asking her to use the payphone and she'd have to break the news to them I'm sorry it's gone yeah. Yeah. sometimes they get upset sometimes they'd want to use her phone sometimes they'd want to use the security oh. guard phone so she begged <laughs> the county and said please get the cell please get the payphone back for two years yeah, and then they brought it back wow. Wow. they are, brought it back are there many payphones around town or is well, this we, the one well we don't know but our friend <laughs> Dave who was Doing making his payphone call tells me he knows of at least three. He, okay. A, yeah, so there's a, so I'm assuming that he's probably the best source of knowledge. He's the that leading Is he anti-smartphone? Like, why doesn't he have he's a cell phone? He's anti-cell phone companies. Oh, oh. Funny. Yes. And I said, what is it like without a cell phone? He said, it's a hassle. I said, yeah. I would expect it would be a Plus hassle. Plus to memorize all those numbers, or does he right. carry around an address book? Oh, I, I don't know. I don't know how many numbers Remember he those. calls. Yeah, but he was calling his brother long distance, so it was going to cost him a Dollars. Does he oh, ride a sense. horse? What other antiquated <laughs> things does he do to kind of live his no, life? He just no? seemed like a normal guy. Just huh. called his brother on the payphone. He was happy he was there because then he didn't have to go down to the post office. Oh, because they have one, one the down others? there too. Uh, yes. Funny. I was surprised by how cheap these things are. Oh yeah. Just to even put one in, right. I would think like, okay, if this woman's fighting to do it for two years, like right. this has got to be like thousands of dollars no. to install. So it was like ninety dollars to get started. <laughs> How did they do this two on, years ago? Ago. And then it was bucks? forty dollars. $40 monthly service. So it's way less yeah. than your cell phone. Yeah, it should pay for itself. It does, yes. Wow. That's funny. <laughs>